Hey Gary Chandler here. Thanks for sending over those videos. Yeah, I love looking at that stuff. So um, when you have like a wedge in your hand, like a lob wedge, sand wedge, gap wedge, even a pitching wedge, you never really want to swing full with those. Um, so like, you know, these are going to be a lot of half swings and three quarter, never really want to take it full and, and never really want to swing really hard through it because um, it's just going to spin the ball too much and, and stuff like that. So you want to swing smooth with your wedges um, and also short. And so um, when you get set up, just feel like you kind of have some knee flex and you're kind of locking your knees in place. And I want you to feel like you're swinging more of your upper body, more of your arm. So basically all you got to do is let your right arm fold let your hands hinge and that's all you need to do and then and then again you don't have to rotate a whole just rotate a little bit and then just swing your arms through and leave your body stable i like to feel like i'm rotating around flexed knees so i'm kind of i'm keep in the back swing i'm keeping this leg stable i'm just rotating around it and then on the way through, I'm rotating around my left knee, and that's stable, and that makes it to where you can't ever over-rotate. Um, so I think that would be big for you, is with your wedges, feel like you're leaving your lower body in place, and you're just swinging your arms, and everything just feels nice and smooth.